Good morning, beautiful people of the internet. Welcome back to another MD Moto Vlog. Well, today I want to talk about cleaning your exhaust pipe. You know, the head is down to uh, the exhaust itself and so on. These past couple of days I've seen a lot of videos on YouTube like guys using like bathroom cleaner like a type of bleach um, that Harpic Plus Max 10 or you know something like that some of the bathroom cleaner that's got like a like a high concentration of bleach in it and it seems to clean the exhaust quite well and I'm thinking maybe I should do that maybe I should give that a try that looks like something that could work I mean my MT-07 is a 2014 model and the exhaust is quite packed on I mean it's got some some heavy heavy wear on it it's like really corroded and brown and orange you know what it looks like so I'm thinking that's a good shot I was thinking about how how you can clean it or if I should use shum 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 sha sha some sort of a metal polish or something I don't know but then I saw some of these videos and I'm like hey that's that looks like a good idea or it looks like it works I mean obviously just afterwards cleaning it properly getting all that bleach off and then it should be fine I mean if you get all the bleach off afterwards shouldn't corrode the metal or affect the metal any further so I'm gonna give that a try hopefully I can put uh, like photos up or do a video of it or actually have it at the end of this video if I'm not too lazy but I'm thinking I'm probably gonna do that as a separate video and you'll be able to see that like a how-to or whatever and the annotation will be at the end you know of this video then another thing I saw which actually I want to you know the little <laughs> that's quite funny I like talk halfway and then I stop you know the other thing I saw what what thing yeah finish your damn sentences the other thing I saw was a video of a guy also doing a few modifications to an MT or an FC07 and uh, it was just a small little thing, you know, the right on the on the back seat, uh, the passenger seat. You've got that little strap that runs across. Now, I have no idea what that is actually for. What? If, if, well, if you know, you know, drop a comment. Tell me what that is actually for, because you mean you're not going to be holding on to that. It's not like a handle. So, you know, let me know. Um, so what he just did is like, uh, took off the back seat, flipped it around, and then you got two little bolts at the bottom uh, that basically hold it down. Take off the bolts, just loosen some of the, there's two little black straps as well, just kind of take them off and take the strap off and put the little thingies back screw it back on click the seat back in and then you've got a really nice clean looking back in looks gives you more of the uh, effect of like having a back cover on there and that looks really cool actually also I think I'm gonna try that little small thing to do just to improve the looks and uh, yeah 
How are you doing? <laughs> you know? Let me know. Tell me what other cool little things you found that you can do to your MT slash FZ07 that makes it look cooler. And as you can see right there, I've got a new little clutch tensioner. It's just blue, you know, <laughs> because because I wanted a blue one. It used to be silver. This uh, stock one is silver, and I thought, you know, change it up, make it fit the bike. I was looking at like new uh, clutch and gear lever as well, but uh, not there yet. But I might just, I might do that. I might switch those out as well. It does give it a much nicer look having those adjustable clutch and brake levers thinking about doing it in black should look pretty sick and sleek but getting there I'll still do that the only thing is I was on eBay and I was looking at them and I'm like but they don't tell you if if it's like a pair or, or individual, I guess I should just, you know, drop the guy a message and ask him. Because I was like, yeah, it's, uh, I'm not sure how much the conversion is to wherever you are, but they are about 260 something rand. That's not bad, that's like, that's cheap. And I'm like, oh, cool. But I don't know if it is um, you know one or two if it's just one so I'm gonna have a look at that and then I'll do those as well I was having a look at a bunch of carbon fiber bits and pieces as well but damn those things are expensive But if you're going to be spending that much on your bike, you're going to, I suppose you want to make sure you're going to keep it. You know, or keep it for a long time. I don't know how long I want to keep the MT-07. I mean, I love it. It's fantastic. It's an awesome bike. But I'm thinking, ride it for another year and I might upgrade. And I might get the MT09, but uh, the new one, I want the 2017 model because that one is just a lot better looking than the old one, I, th I think, personally. You know, everybody's got their own opinion on that, so which is fine. If you like the old one better, nothing uh, to you, that's perfect. But yeah, that's the plan, I'm thinking. Woo, that was nice. Nice with a bit of spice. Dropped it a little bit too hard there. Damn it! I haven't been riding that much. I've actually been away on vacation for weeks. I haven't been riding in like, I don't know, a week and a half. That is why I'm so shitty. Sort of. I'm still learning though. You can never learn enough. Bit of a nod of the head there for fellow biker. Don't know why I just went semi-British there. 
<clears throat> Yo, I've got something in my throat. I ate some oats and uh, I think there's still something in my blocking my throat hole. You know, let's circle back to the first thing here, which was, <laughs> which we actually were talking about cleaning the exhaust. So, let me know if that's a good idea. I've seen a lot of guys do it. It looks like it works. I hope it works. Because it'd be awesome if I can have a clean exhaust again. Just down the headers. I mean, I've got a stock exhaust on it anyway. So, I'm not going to be too sad if something fucks up. Because it's a piece of shit. So hopefully it'll just work. But thank you for watching guys once again. And as always please like, please subscribe, check out some future videos, check out some old videos. And uh enjoy it enjoy your day guys enjoy your days come back remember the main thing is come back so hit that subscribe button and i will see you later goodbye goodbye <laughs>